Why are you so violent? I'm not. Are you saying you're not violent? I just have a lot of energy sometimes. <laughs> Keep drowning me out. I can't me. We are in Jiyu Gaoka today, and it is. Oh, hold on. Sorry, sorry, sorry. So, we're in Jiyu Gaoka today, and it's known as Europe Town, a little Europe here in Japan. And it's so pretty. The weather is gorgeous. It's finally warming up. So, we're going to go and check out a couple of things. I guess that could be. Japan's interpretation of what European traits could look like, what a European lunch could look like. I don't know, options are plenty and I suck at making decisions. So come along while we um, decide to very haphazardly what to do and where to go. <laughs> There's a cool penthouse like right up there. Imagine like living up there. They seem pretty rich because look at all these cars they got down here. Holy fucking shit. I mean, holy shoot. Right, never mind the other cars they had in this garage. They got a freaking Rolls Royce. You love Rolls Royce. Like the Royce potato chips that we had with the chocolate on top. Is that the same brand? probably address the elephant in there. Oh yeah? See his hair's blue. No it isn't, it's just the lighting. <laughs> We've been lying to our family and friends. <laughs> <laughs> that it's just the lighting in every photo that we post. Yeah, we're yeah. in our... Sorry everyone. <laughs> In our pictures and stuff, I try to zoom past Dean as quickly as possible. Yeah. Sorry. Nick especially. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, we sent my friend Nick like a picture directly of my blonde hair and he was like, hey, did Dean dye his hair? And we said no. <laughs> I'm sorry, Nick. <laughs> Almost gaslighted him. He's like, no, I don't know what you're on about. It's just the lighting. Anyway, life's yeah. more fun with uh, this color hair, you know, we're just carefree and... Um, yeah, a bit Kurt Cobain-ish, a whole new guy. Packing away the cash. Gotta keep the goods safe. What did you think of that place? It was really tasty. Mm. Um, I got the chicken and mushroom kind of mix. <laughs> <laughs> and the vegetables were really nice as well. Mum, I'm eating my veggies. Uh, what did you get again? Uh, it was like a pork chop, like lemon peel pork chop or something with some veggies. Yeah. It tasted like this Greek dish, fricasse. And it was really good. It reminded me of my grandma's one. Yeah? Would yeah. you pick this one or your grandma's one? My grandma's always. Always. Yeah. All right, on to the next stop. Let's go. I want some dessert. Let's, uh... Here. That's Babo. you. Hey! That's you. No, I'm not. You're Babo. You're the Babo. See ya. The 
little baby wanted to come to the Peter Rabbit Cafe. Look at that, it's so cute. <laughs> Let me tell you about the tale of the pie and the patty pan. There once was a man named Patty. He had a pan. What? Your hair's blue. Well, she's crying. <laughs> it's so cute. Can I eat it yet? <laughs> no. I got the creme brulee French toast. What'd you get? I just got some French toast. He wake up some French toast. Oh, it's so tasty. The haters. Oh my god, I love this place. <laughs> my bunny's coming to visit your bunny. Where's your bunny? Oh, he Where's got, your bunny? He got eaten. Bean! Oh. <laughs> Alright, pink cheek bug. Yeah. After eating all that ice cream and creme brulee. How are you feeling? It was really, really good. I'm gonna go on a mad sugar crush. Rat, sugar crush? No, sugar, sugar crush. That's sugar the famous crush. thing. There was a cute couple who were on a date and they took our photo and we took their photo. We became best friends. Over on the Peter Rabbit casting couch. That's the date couch right now. Here. After having some creme brulee French toast, we have some French beans. Awesome. <laughs> I cleaned it up very nicely. Didn't leave any mess. <laughs> like this mess. Bean! <laughs> Gucci's here and bridal shaving aroma. Your fave. That's how I smelt nice for our wedding. Ew. <laughs> It's nearly sunset. We're at a gorgeous park with a gorgeous boy. That's no, you. It's not a gorge, it's a ravine. Uh, <laughs> what's a ravine? Oh, I don't like how you just ignored my fantastic joke, but that's okay. Oh. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> we're at Todoroki Ravine Park, mm -hmm. and apparently it's just a bit untamed and wild and it's just like a, a ravine looking thing and there's uh, plants and stuff and trees and all that sort of stuff there's a cute dog coming this way they just let it go wild and let nature do its thing it's kind of really cool let's explore How would my mum pose for this? Oh, cute. No, she wouldn't. That's more Lily. Clay. Your mum's poses are my favourite. <laughs> <laughs> See that? A couple of dunks. <laughs> which one's you, which one's me? I'm the one running away from you. <laughs> Come back. <laughs> This one's left behind. Nick! <laughs> Lots of ducks here. They're all being friends with each other. You don't see this many ducks in Melbourne unless you're in Springvale. <laughs> and they're all kind of hanging out. Oh.
Look at him. <laughs> he's so tiny! Look at him, he's so tiny! <laughs> Some golden light filmed by a golden boy. You're a golden boy. You're the golden bee. Bug. You walk up here, just along the ravine. Yeah. Oh my god. There's a like a bunch of shops up here. A little cafe, restaurant. You can go up there. There's one up there too. Oh man. Anyway, this is where I'm announcing that I'm moving to Japan. No. Tea's but coming with me. me. Oh, We're okay. moving here together. Pizza, pasta, all oh, yeah. It was made in 99. <laughs> <laughs> Dangerous okay. route or the safe route? Safe. Okay. She's a big fan of ghost whisperer. You know, I did this at school camp once and I fell in to the mud. She's always talking about crossing over. So what do you think of today? Uh, you know, today was the best. That's about it. I just love these days where you sort of kind of go out with one thing in mind and then you end up in a completely different spot with something you didn't expect. Yeah. Um, that ravine was crazy. And that it, temple at the end was, was really nice. And we only explored like a part of the ravine because it's starting to get dark because it's still winter time. So the sun leaves us a little earlier but I'm traveling around with the golden sun, the golden boy. So I always have a bit of light in my life. Do you want to say how you did my hair? <laughs> well, actually, excuse me. I told you one box would not of dye would not be enough. And I was right. So we had to go out and buy more dye. That's not the problem. Old my hair left me looking like a zebra. There was a big brown patch here and all this was... Wild. I was trying to spread the product yes. evenly Did in all your hair. Did you put enough here? Did you put enough? I was trying to totally get your fine, mate. Don't worry about it. Next minute, I'm looking like a zebra. <laughs> but that's okay. We got there in the end. Yeah, and you're beautiful right now. Oh, thanks. First and you got yours done at the, the salon. Yeah, I went to number 76 in Tokyo in Omete Sando. Thank you to Natsumi. She did a great job. You always look a little blue now though. Oh, shush, shush. <laughs> We're kind of like opposite colours now, you know? You're yeah. brighter, I'm darker. Mm. But deep inside, I'm kinder. I've always been the fun one, <laughs> the kind one, and you've always been the, um, the emo one. That's not true. Yeah. That's not true at all. <laughs> all right, well, thanks for watching. All right, what do we say, my love? I'm cutting you in again. No, subscribe! <laughs> no, no, no! Bye.